Unit one, exercise one. One. I've had my current job for four years. I got the job after I'd been with my airline for five years, so I've been flying for nine years. I was happy to get a pay increase, but the best part of the job is going on international flights. I had to pass an English test for that, and now I have a regular flight schedule. I got very tired of being on call and having to go to work whenever the phone rang. Two. I started as a flight attendant nineteen years ago. I've worked for three different airlines. Now I've got the top job. I've been doing it for a year. I'm in charge of running the whole cabin. I tell the flight crew when the cabin is secure for takeoff and landing. I make all the announcements. And I report any missing or broken emergency equipment to the pilots after the pre-flight check. I operate the doors too. I also look after the manifest, take care of all the required paperwork and reports for each flight, and also account for all of the money. Three. I'm a new recruit. I finished my training eighteen months ago, and I've been doing this job for about a year. It's hard work, but I love it. My main responsibility is passenger safety. Of course, I also look after passengers' comfort, but safety is the most important thing. A lot of passengers don't understand that. <laughs> Some people think I'm a waiter. Four. I've had this job for two years, but I've been with the airline for twelve years. I'm responsible for the entire cabin and all the flight attendants. I report to the cabin service director. We work closely together, so sometimes I make announcements, help with the doors, or take care of paperwork. I enjoy the responsibility.